Okay, we back at the, the Olivedale old farmhouse. We did a removal here from the swimming pool pump, the cover of the swimming pool pump, which was just over there on the left. Now they've got bees that have settled in the electricity box at the back here. You won't be able to see the dark. We're going to move in there now. Um, I don't know if you can see there's an old barbet's nest up in the tree there. Um, the bottom's fallen out. They had bees in that barbet's nest as well. So, yeah, there's been quite a few swarms on this property. So, watch this episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And, uh, yeah, let's see what we're in for. So, yeah, as you can see, a bunch of debris over here. The little top corner there. This piece. So, what's happened is the top piece of that has all rusted away. And so, it's given an entrance for the bees to go in. See the top left corner there and also on the top right. When I was here to just do an inspection, uh, the bees were quite calm. Uh, when I opened up the hive, they didn't really fly out. It was around this time as well, so it's still mostly daylight outside. There's a nice little dark spot in the back of the garden against the wall. A couple of bees flying around now. Smoke is not going very well. The bees have gone in. Do you put a blast of white and see what happens? Yeah. But do you see what I mean? Like it's a, it's a decent sized colony. Yeah. They definitely fill up a six frame. Very calm, eh? Very calm, yeah. Sure, they ran, eh? To the back. Well, that's fine. They can't really get out. Yeah, you're passing a knife or something. Bollocks. What's that? I dropped a piece with a bunch of bees on it. Damn it. This next piece. This was facing outside. The side, other side was facing inwards. Okay. And the other side has brood on it, I believe. There's no electricity there. Uh, there is a switch here, but it's down. It's over here. I'm working up over here at the top. Of the and I don't see any exposed wires on it, so. Some nice pieces. Mm, that's quite a thick bee shape, man. Yeah. Yeah, this next piece has a lot of brood on it. And honey. The queen is still in here, I can tell you that much. Eh? Where I put the hive to. Yeah. Because I can see bees still here fanning. She's scurried to the back. That's what she normally does. Yeah. Oh, no. 
can tell you he's the queen. That's how you should climb up. There's still a piece behind this. Okay, so, job done. Uh, we cleared it all out. It's looking nice and empty, not seeing any bees around. Um, didn't take us too long, to us about an hour to do this, uh, which is quite reasonable for the size of hive it was and where it is. Um, we're gonna take them through to the apri, um, uh, it's towards Kailami and uh, they should have a nice happy home over there. We'll see you there. It's a cool shot. Yeah, it can show us dusting the bees off into it. Near the beginning. Smoke is going if you feed. You want me to give them a pub cook or not yet, not yet. Just let them going there. You need to go gentle. Yeah, just make sure the box is placed on properly. You'll be the to here. What are you thinking? I'd say job well done. You know, look, I... I'm going to tell if this colony is going to stay here because we don't use queen birds, queen birds anymore. Uh, so, we'll wait and see. Okay, it was a good removal tonight. We did it at, uh, within a nice hour. Uh, it didn't take long. At the Apri here, it seems like our other two hives are doing really well. Um, they both have supers on them. This hive will be a while before we super them up. They could have gone into a six frame hive, but the 10 frame should work. Hopefully it's not too big for them and they don't just uh, end up moving out. Hopefully they stay with us. Uh, if you enjoyed this episode, remember to like, remember to subscribe. Hit the little bell icon if you want to get notified when we upload. And we'll see you in the next video.